the Czech Army and Air Force do not currently have aircraft equipped to evacuate large groups or move soldiers with significant equipment across great distances. Sarnokova pointed out that the evacuations from Afghanistan and Sudan have shown the critical need for these capabilities. She also mentioned the worsening international security situation as another reason for the immediate need to obtain these planes. I am happy that we will receive the first plane next year, she said. The Czech Republic plans to acquire the C-390s under similar terms as our allied nations, with the expected cost of the planes matching or even exceeding that of what other nations have spent, despite often ordering larger numbers in addition to the planes themselves. The Ministry of Defense will also buy a variety of extra equipment to enhance the plane's functions. This includes systems for aerial firefighting, medical evacuations, and refueling while in the air. Additionally, the package includes ground support gear, the first spare parts, and training for personnel. The total cost of this purchase which includes these extras, is CZK 11.3 billion excluding VAT. With a consideration of a currency reserve in the price, I am confident that we have secured the best possible deal, Sarnokova declared. The C-390 Millennium is designed to handle heavy military gear, and is outfitted with modules for different tasks like aerial firefighting and transporting patients needing intensive care. It is also equipped with extra fuel tanks for longer flights, self-protection systems for operations in dangerous areas, and equipment for aiding in search and rescue operations, the plane can also provide top-notch passenger transport and GPS navigation systems for special forces. This agreement also guarantees significant participation from the Czech defense industry. A recently concluded industrial cooperation agreement ensures collaboration with domestic companies notably Aero Vodochodi Aerospace will increase its production capabilities. And LOM Praha, a state-owned company, will be involved in the maintenance of the planes. Embraer will also work with Czech universities on research into autonomous systems and aviation projects. The overall economic benefit of this collaboration program is expected to be over 82.3 million US dollars.